Welcome to Tips and Tricks for PsycInfo. In this third tutorial, we'll examine options to help you search PsycInfo more effectively. Remember always to start at the USC Libraries homepage and to log in. PsycInfo is a database, so scroll down and click on Databases. Once in Databases, click on the PsycInfo link under Quick Links. In previous tutorials, we used the Boolean term OR to combine terms. Let me show you another way. Let's take this question, start with the author keyword, employee recruitment. Type the keyword phrase in the search box and include it in quotation marks. Without the quotation marks, ProQuest searches for each separate instance of the word. Click the search icon. Because there are only a few results, let's look for a related subject term. Scroll down and click on a citation. Now scroll down and look at the subject headings. Let's click on Personnel Recruitment. For this next concept, let's go to the advanced search. An author could use woman or woman, female or females as their keyword. We can use the question mark to search for both woman or woman. For females, let's use the asterisk. This searches for female, females, femaleness, female-like. Scroll down and click the search icon. The last part of our question was on training. However, if we look at the thesaurus, typing training and clicking the find button, we can see there are a lot of different kinds of training. If you're looking for a specific kind of training, use the thesaurus subject term. Otherwise, let's just clear the search box and type in the word training and click the search icon. Now we can combine these searches. Click on recent searches and scroll down to see your previous searches. Combine searches with similar terms by typing the search number with the Boolean term OR and putting parentheses around them. One or two, employee recruitment or personnel recruitment as a subject heading. Narrow our search by combining searches with different concepts using the AND option. AND three and four. AND woman and female and training. Click the search button. The advantage to this method is that you can explore separate parts of your search before combining them. Just a quick note, I use the asterisk and question mark to show how they work. However, if you look under subject terms, you can see that 59 are specifically coded as focusing on females. We can click more options to include and exclude different topics from our search. In this case, I'm going to include females, scroll down, and click Apply. The applied limits now are visible in the left navigation bar and under Recent Searches. Happy searching!